<laughs> okay, it's like you like this matter of the spiritual realm so much. So I'll address a little bit on it. Um, well, if you have ever had to run deliverance on people, one or two persons, you may understand what I'm trying to say because most times it's easy to just see the bastardization of what people do online in the name of deliverance and all. But let me tell you the truth, those manifestations, most of them are real. You will not believe it until most times you find yourself on that effect of those powers. And I'm telling you the truth. This is not in any way to glorify Satan or whatever, but let me tell you the truth. One way Satan also keeps you in bondage is by making you deny the reality of the realm of spirit. How do you believe you will go to heaven? That is a spiritual place. And then you don't believe that there is an existence in that place. It's not true. It means you're just denying. It's not adding up. So um, one time I was going to run deliverance on this lady who was having issues around um, around um, um, lesbianism majorly and then um, because I had not handled that issue before I told the Lord I needed clarity to see the spirits responsible for that because I had not done that before I had done deliverances for people in different areas then uh, and um, the, you know the prophetic had always been active until now okay but then it was majorly based on that and then I, I prayed when to seek the Lord because when you know the spirit's responsible you can know on what terms to play the matters of the spirit over that case so I saw two beings two beings now these things are not joke and I mean it from the depth of my spirit well, <laughs> the spirit realm will not lie so they know what I'm saying now I saw two short beings two short dwarf beings and then they were like bonded together like twins okay and then the funny thing is that the lord wrote you know made me will make me under make me understand that these were the spirit responsible for these gay practices now guess what happens now what what they do is that both of them see a fellow they want to attack then they latch on one fellow then they look for another fellow who is bankrupt of the word of god and also um, has already been lost in naturally immorally so what they do is that the other twin goes to latch on the other person now because those short demons are bonded in the spirit what really bonds people to people in that wise is the spirit so it's not as though the man looks at a fellow man and is wondering you're, you're, you're beautiful or whatever in that sense and guess what? In this wise, it was two ladies, you know. So one bonded, you know, latched himself on the other, the other one. And mind you, they have different access points pornography, what you hear, you know, your emotions uncontrolled or untethered by God's word. So where they latch on to now, you know, the way you put, let's imagine. Put on your body a huge magnet and then you put on another person a huge magnet that is strong enough to pull at, at least one meter notice the magnet attached to you begins to pull you together that's how it operated and so when i saw that i asked the lord what to do and then the lord said to me cast out the demons from them both of them those involved cast out the demons from both of them now the demons will still meet but excluding them now that was exactly and you need to see what happened trust me i can go on and on saying this very clearly but i'm telling you the truth you downplay the realm of the spirit you're really a joker this is the same thing with destiny help us with matters of favor when god wants to favor you he puts something in you it could be a gift it could be a liking it could be he puts something in you and replicates the desire in somebody else the same way he puts the interpretation of dreams in joseph and puts the need for that interpretation in pharaoh until pharaoh found joseph there was no connection it was until that ring led to and pharaoh's hand to joseph you know that bond happened and guess what all through 
um, Joseph's existence with Pharaoh, that bond stayed, stayed. And so you must be very conscious, knowing that this realm is controlled much more by what happens in the spirit realm. And I pray for you much more, okay, that your own spiritual senses are activated much more in the direction of positive area. You must understand matters of dreams. These are also access points. But we'll talk about that some other time. I pray in the name of Jesus to everyone who is watching through may your spiritual sensitive organs be activated towards everything that concerns the fulfillment of your destiny in jesus name remember well god bless you next question